Chris Bonga. Today I'm going to introduce you this uh, chapter, which is Unit 5, Demographic and Ecological Problems. Demographic has been already seen. Today we are going to see the second, it will be the ecological problems. So the activity one, Activity one. So you will choose the correct synonym for the term ecological. So it will be the definition. I give you three examples. Sorry, choose the correct. Choose the correct. Synonym, choose the correct synonym, synonym for the term, for the term ecological, ecological. So I will give you three examples. It will be up to you to choose the best answer. The first one, A, technical, technical. The second one is B, natural, and the last one is C, Environment. Sorry. Sorry. So, so here you will. So, let me come back. I think here. It's not clear. Let me come down. The C should be here. I think environment. Environmental. Environmental. So you have three, three answers here. It's up to you to choose the best one. The first one is A is the Ecological terms means technical, natural, or environmental. So here, the best answer is, yes, the best answer is this one, is environmental. Because the words, the words, um, what can I say, ecological means environment it is the same words okay so c is the best answer we will move to the second activity that will be activity 2 defining the term ecological problems d Finding the term ecological problem. Ecological problems. Here, once again, I will write we have three proposals. It will be up to you. It will be up to you to choose the best answer. So let me write those proposal. Which definition, which definition best corresponds, corresponds to the term to the term 
to the term ecological problems. Ecological problems. So I will give you three proposals. It will be up to you to choose the best definition. The first one, A. Ecological problems are technical problems due to machines. Ecological, ecological problems, ecological problems are technical are technical problems problems due to machines due to machines this is the first proposal the second proposal which means b It is, ecological problems are those caused to environment by man or nature. Ecological, ecological problems, problems are those, those caused, those caused to environment to environment to environment by man or nature by man or nature full stop and the last one it will be c as I said, ecological problems are just natural problems. C. Ecological. Ecological. Problems. Ecological problems are just. Ecological problems are just natural just natural problems. So here you have three proposals. The A says ecological problems are technical problems due to machines. The B, ecological problems are those caused to environment by man or nature. And C, ecological problems are just natural problems. So here, you have to choose the best answer. According to you, where is the best answer here? It's up to you to give the answer between A, B, and C. So, the best answer is, is B. Yes, the best answer is B. Ecological problems are those caused to environment by man or nature. As you know very well, in ecology, there are man-made man -made action and natural action. So this one was the activity two of our lesson. So we will move further to see the activity three. Activity three. Activity three. Activity three. So here the activity three, it is the selected vocabulary that you have in English, and we will have also answers in French. So it will be up to you to choose the best answers. So here we have some words. Let me write some of the words. We have words in English, words in English. The first one is an earthquake, a 
9 quick. What is an earthquake? I think you know it in French. What it means, number two. An earth tremor. Number three, drought. Droughts. No, drought is not, excuse me, it's in singular. Four, noxious. The word number five, I think you are working on it. We need the meaning in French. So you have to give the best answers. I will give you some French words. I think yourself, you can also, with your experience, try to translate this word into French. Number five is industrial, industrial waste. Industrial waste. Because this word, in this activity, what you have to do is to find, it is to find, excuse me, to find the French meaning, the French meaning, the French meaning for the English, for the English, for the English words, words on your left, on your left. I will write some English word. I think that you are working. Don't wait for my, don't expect my answers. Work yourself and then we are going to correct it together. So here, It's not clear, I think. On your left. On your left. On your, your left. Okay, full stop. So, the sixth is household waste. House Hold waste. How house hold waste. Okay, so this is number one, two, three, four, five, six. We have the seventh one will be so landslide. Landslide. After landslide, we have uh, deforestation, deforestation, deforestation. After deforestation, we have ozone layer. No, the ozone layer ranking, it's number nine. Ozone layer ranking. We have number 10. The number 10 will be species disappearance. Species, 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 species disappearance. Disappearance, disappearance. Number 11. I think that you keep on working. Don't expect my answers, please. You work at home. Thank you. Climate changes. Climate changes. Climate changes. 
climate changes. Number 12 will be the greenhouse effect. Greenhouse, greenhouse effect. Greenhouse effect. And uh, the last one will be the uh, B13, a flood. So, you have in this activity what you should do just to give the meaning of these words. This, these meanings are taken from the ecological problems. So, what you have to do to translate, giving the meaning into French. So, an earthquake, an earthquake. What is an earthquake in French? An earthquake. What is an earthquake? It is tremblement de terre. Tremblement, le tremblement, tremblement de terre. Tremblement de terre. Okay, as I said, here you have to give the French word. An earthquake, it's when the earth is shaking. So you said the answer is tremblement de terre. Very good, very, very good. What about the earth tremor? Can you give the example of earth tremor? You know, you see the earthquake, earth tremor. It looks like. What is the meaning? What is the meaning? Yes? It's the same thing when the earth is shaking. Can you give an answer in French? Yes? Ah, secousse. Secousse sismique. Secousse seismique. Very good. Very good. What about the drought? So the drought, you know very well. In the Congo, we have two seasons. We have the rainy season, and we have the dry season. So what is the drought? What is the drought? In English, the drought is the absence of rain. So tell me in English, absence of rain. Yes? OK, very good. Sécheresse. 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 Very good. And what about this one? Noxious. What about noxious? Can you give me the answer? Yes? What about this one? Who can give the answer about this one? About noxious? Who can give me? Noxious. Noxious is something that is poisonous. It's a poison. So when you, 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 you're breathing, if your air contains the poison, you will die. So this one, it is the same. What is no noxious in French? Like a poison. Yes? What is it? What is noxious? Who can give me an example? Yes. Nocif. C'est quelque chose qui est nocif. C'est du poison. In English, we call it noxious. Here we come to number five, industrial waste. What is a waste? What is a waste? Because you will have industrial waste, you will have household waste. The key word here is waste. What is waste? Every time, every day, in our house, we, we consume product. At the end, everything we product, we go, we throw it somewhere. How do we call it? How do we call it in French? The waste. Industrial waste. Yes? OK, déchet. Le déchet. Déchets au pluriel et déchets industriels. Industriels. 
les déchets industriels. In English, we call it industrial waste. And we come to number six. The number six is household waste. The household waste is what we consume every day. When we consume something, we go, we throw it somewhere. Yes? In your house, when you eat sometimes, or bread, when you eat something, it can be a product. Anything you, 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 you consume, at the end, you go, you throw it to Averda. You throw it to Averda. What do you throw there? Household waste. Yes, it is, in French, ordure. This one will be different. This is household. So, ordure. Quel genre d'ordure? Ménagère. Ordure. Ménagère. And we come to the seventh one. So here it is landslide. The landslide, if you see the news, in India what is going on, there is a big rain, heavy rain, that is provoking the landslide. What is a landslide? What is a landslide? People living in a mountain, sometimes when it rains, there is landslide, they lose their houses, and so on and so forth. What is the landslide? What is a slide? Because here it is composed of two words. You have land and you have slide. You have land and slide. What is land? What is slide? So, you can sometimes, it can, if you are in a mountain, when you come, it can push you down sometimes to slide. To slide is the way when you do like this, to slide. What is to slide? In French, oh, glissement, 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 land is terrain, de terrain, very good, very good. And here, you know it very well, deforestation, deforestation, it comes from French, you see, you have the forest. When you cut trees, when you cut trees, and there is no more trees, how do you call it in, in English, in French? It is the same word, deforestation. Deforestation. And we have already dealt with all this. We come to the ozone layer ranking. Oh, ozone layer ranking. This one is a little bit difficult for you. Let me explain you what is ozone layer. The ozone layer, it's what? The ozone layer, for example, we live in, this is the planet, Earth. This is our planet, Earth. Uh, I don't know how to draw. Congo is somewhere here, for example. And you have the sun. This is the sun. The sun is here. And there is one thing that protects the earth from sunbeams. From sunbeams. This is what we call by ozone. Ozone layer. The ozone layer protect the earth from sun beams. So this, in English, we call it the beams. This is the beams. So its role is to protect the earth from sun beams. Imagine, there is nothing. There is no ozone layer to protect the earth, so there will be no life on earth. So what is ozone layer ranking? Ozone layer, it is couche d'ozone. La destruction, the ranking is destruction. So, destruction, destruction de la couche, couche d'ozone. Couche d'ozone, c'est l'ozone. Ozone layer, couche d'ozone. 
couche d'ozone. Number 10 is species disappearance. The most difficult word here, it is species. So disappearance, it's like in French, it sounds the same. Disappear, species disappearance. What does it mean? Species disappearance. Who can give me the answer about species disappearance? Species disappearance. Yes? Species disappearance. Who can give me the answer? Species disappearance. Yes? Species disappearance. So it sounds like French. So the answer, the answer is, yes, it's too long to write, so let me write it here. It is disparition des espèces. Disparition des espèces. <coughs> disparition des espèces. So, climate change, everywhere in our media, uh, we talk about climate change. What is the climate change? This is very easy. What is the climate change? Because in Brazzaville, before, the temperature was very low. Now, you, you see, these days, the weather becomes more and more sunny. More and more sunny. It's due to what? It's due to climate changes. What are the climate changes? The climate changes. You have the climate, which means in French, as easy, climat, and changes, changement. So, ce sont les changements climatiques. Very good. Changement, les changements climatiques. Changements climatiques. Ce sont les changements climatiques. So, this is... The, no, the last one is flood. We come to the greenhouse effect. The greenhouse effect. What is the greenhouse effect? So, the greenhouse effect, it is how the gases are uh, the man. It can be also the, natu the nature produces. The greenhouse effect, it's what we produce. It goes up to the atmosphere, the one which is which is causing the climate change. We call it in English the greenhouse effect. So the greenhouse effect in French, we can say easily greenhouse. Uh, don't, don't translate, uh, don't translate uh, word by word. Otherwise, you would say green, it is vert, and a house. Maison, it is not maison vert, attention. It is greenhouse effect. The greenhouse effect here, it is gaz à effet de serre. Gaz à effet de serre. The gaz à effet de serre. It is the greenhouse gases. So, we come to the end of our activity. It will be about the flood. What is the flood? What is the flood? For those who live close to the river, or who live close to La Tieme, or those who live close to Maduku, when there is a heavy rain, so what happened? So there is the, the river, sometimes, it goes up, and it goes everywhere, and it goes in the house. So we call it the floods. So the floods, the flood in French, what can we say about the flood? Right now in India, there is heavy rains, very heavy rains provoking the floods. So people don't have house uh, to live because the house is full of water, full of water. For people who live close to river, like Maduku, who live like, uh, uh, I don't know, you know very well, 
we have Maduku, we have uh, Latsime, and so on and so forth. So water will come up, it will come out to the house, so there is no place to stay. So Euroblad ran away, we call it the flood. So the flood is inondation. 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 Thank you very much. Thank you very much. We come to the end of this activity. I just want you to pronounce after me. So the word number one is an earthquake. You say earthquake. Number two, an earth tremor. Earth tremor. Number three, the drought. Drought. Number four, noxious. Noxious. Number five, industrial waste. Industrial waste. Number six, household waste. The household waste. Household waste. Number seven, landslide. 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 Number eight, deforestation. Deforestation. This is very easy for you. De deforestation is like in French. Number nine, ozone layer ranking. Ozone layer ranking. You don't say ozone layer rank. No. This one is mute. Don't pronounce this one. You say ranking. Here, species disappearance. Species disappearance. Species disappearance. 11. Climate changes. Climate changes. Number 12. Greenhouse effect. Greenhouse effect. And at last, number 13. A flood. A flood. You repeat, a flood. So you have the meaning in French. I don't need to come here. So this is the end of our third activity. So I want you, as you have got all these words, we have one, two, three, four, nine, uh, sorry, one, two, three, four, five, six, six, seven, eight, nine, 11, 12, 13, to find at least nine out of these 13 words in order to see our last exercise, which will come very soon. So the last exercise will be here. It is the text on vocabulary. So I will read it for you, okay? So what you are going to do here, because with this text, you will fill in blanks. So text on vocabulary, exercise, fill in the blanks with a suitable word from the list below seen in the lesson. So the lesson is here. We have the vocabulary, all these words. So we will have some fill, blank, uh, we will fill some blanks. So it will up to you to do that exercise. So let me read for you. <clears throat> exercise, fill in the blanks with the suitable words from the list below seen in the lesson. So we have these words. We have already seen those words here. So we have species disappearance, floods, greenhouse effect, ozone layer, drought, deforestation, earthquake, climate changes, and slide. So it will be up to you. So the text here is, let me read it for you. What feature for the environment? Our environment is terribly threatened. Most human activities are achieved in complete indifference of the damages they may cause to the nature. So we have the following. We'll continue here. Nowadays, it is obvious that the ranking of the, 
So here, there is a, a blank. It's up to you to fill. The mm, I will not give you the answer, is greatly responsible for the it we are experiencing worldwide. Those terrible it often go along with its number two, answer number two, which means the absence of rains. It's up to you to imagine. Not to imagine, but to give the good answers. In certain other areas, the earth shakes. That phenomenon causes, mm -mm, causes many disasters. Recently, N, number three, has been recorded in Croatia. If rains are another source of calamities, they engender, is number four, and provoke, number five, to the point that men are buried alive surprisingly. Ecological, disaster, ecological disasters are natural and man-made. However, man is more responsible. Indeed, industries emit, this is number six, gases responsible for, number seven, in addition, the savage cutting down of trees or, this is number eight, carries along with it another dangerous and pitiful reality of. So it is up to you to give the answer. Number one, number two, number three, number four, number five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So. Here, this vocabulary is related to our class. All the activities we have seen here, it is summed up by this exercise. So it is up to you to give the correct answers. What about number one? You want me to repeat? You want me to repeat? So let me repeat maybe. For the good comprehension, you have here, this is where we started. This is where we started. What feature for the environment? Let me read quite quickly. What feature for the environment? Our environment is, terrible, is terribly threatened. Most human activities are achieved in complete indifference of the damages they may cause to the nature. Nowadays, it's obvious that the ranking of the number one is greatly responsible for the it we are experiencing worldwide. Those terrible it often goes along with number two, which means the absence of rains. In certain other areas, the earth shakes. That phenomenon causes many disasters. Recently, N, number three, has been recorded in Croatia. If rains are another source of calamities, they engender number four and provoke, this is number five, to the point that men are buried alive surprisingly. Ecological disasters are natural and man-made. However, man is more responsible. Indeed, industrial industries emit Number six, gas is responsible for number seven. In addition, the savage cutting down of trees, or this is number eight, carries along with carry, carries along with it another dangerous and pitiful reality of number nine. What is the answer number one in this exercise? Answer number one here, let me give it. It's ozone layer. Ozone layer. It is answer number one. Number two, it the drought. 
it is in the plural drought, excuse me. Number three, it is earthquake. 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 Number four, the floods. Floods. Number five, landslide. Landslide. Number six, the green greenhouse effect. Greenhouse effect. Greenhouse effect. Number seven. The number seven is climate change or climate changes. Climate changes. Climate changes. Climate changes. Number eight. What is number eight? Number eight is what? Yes, deforestation. 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 And at last, at last, number nine, number nine, yes, species, the species, 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 disappearance. Sorry, excuse me. Species disappearance. Species disappearance. So you have all these words. So this is just a sum up. Normally, we should have written all these words to include it in the text. So to save time, if it were the exam, the, the exam you just go one, two, three, four, and you give the answers. So when you take each of them, you put it in this blank, so you will have our complete, our complete text, which is about ecological problem. Thanks for watching. See you next time. It was a pleasure and goodbye.